black queen goddess of the earth. Yes, that's the vibes it's giving me, okay? What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Diamond, and I'm back with another video. This will be a tutorial on how I got this hairstyle. So if you're new here, thank you all for coming. Please hit the subscribe button. And if you're a returning subscriber, you are the shit. I love you. <laughs> you be watching my videos. Thank you so much. <laughs> no, but <laughs> thank you for returning. And girl, let's get into this horror, okay? <laughs> So y'all, I'm in the process of detangling my hair with shampoo comb. I'm just really working with the top half. I washed it and put it in um, some like pigtail braids, plateau, whatever you wanna call them, braids last night. Moisturized my hair and I got some cornrows in the back. I'm not really gonna show y'all too much because they're nappy and I don't feel like rebraiding them. My hair was wet and I just braided it like that so it could dry because I'm really not doing anything with the back. So I moisturized it and braided it down. I'm only gonna be working with the front because once you guys see, I'll be working with a half wig and you don't even see the back of my head. But right now, I'm about to make a straight part across my head. And I'm really just about to talk to y'all because I don't feel like doing a voiceover. Like, I feel like it's just so much more work to do a voiceover. Like, I gotta record the video, then I gotta look at the video and explain everything to y'all and I could just kill two birds on my phone and explain everything and why I'm doing it. So, that's what we got going. I always use one of these little rat tail things because they get my parts good and straight as I could possibly get them my, doing it myself. I'm trying to see if I wanna bring this up a little bit more. I feel like I want to bring it up a little bit more. I feel like the part is too far back. So yeah, basically y'all, um, today was just a rough day. I ain't gonna say the whole day was rough, but the ending was rough. The last few hours was irritating as fuck. Okay. I was so annoyed. So to begin with, um to begin with King you just into everything right now and it's just so hard to just do normal shit and not keep eyes literally locked on him 24-7. So basically, King got into something earlier. He had the age where he put everything in his mouth. So I'm not sure what happened, but I think he ate something he wasn't supposed to eat, and I'm just, I'm just annoyed and disappointed because I really thought that he was in the living room watching a movie, and he really went to Wilson House, and I was sitting on the computer trying to make some orders and stuff like that. And he got quiet and the intro was like, where is King? And I'm like, he's, he's in the, in the, um, in the family room looking at a movie. <sighs> and please don't ask me what did he eat because I don't, obviously I didn't disclose that information for a reason. 
I don't, I don't, I don't feel like talking about it because I'm irritated. And it's just, I feel just, um, I feel irresponsible, okay? It's a little bit embarrassing, but he's fine. He's good. Everything's cool. <laughs> On top of that, I just feel like sometimes he has a little irritating with his parenting with me together when we're parenting. I just feel like he don't be handling the situations right, and he, I don't, he definitely didn't handle the situation right. Anytime something happened with King that's not supposed to happen, I feel like he never knows how to handle the situation. It's just like, let's make sure he's okay, everything is good, together, and then if you want to point the finger or say something about the situation, do it. But first, let's make sure he's okay. And I don't know, I just felt like he didn't do that. He made his comments and I kind of just dealt with it myself, made sure he was okay. and. He just claims that when he something happens, he just be so upset he don't think about nothing else. He just mad. <laughs> Whatever. So right now what I'm doing is just braiding a braid straight across something to hook the half wig on when I put it on. Give it some security. It ain't gotta be neat, cause it, again, this is not gonna be showing right here. It's a spray straight across. So y'all, I just parted my hair like this, straight down the middle, then the part here, then the part here. Besides the whole king situation. Um, what else happened today? I ended up looking at my email and come to find out they canceled my order for King's birthday shirt. It was a little cute Gucci shirt. Um, mind you, our trip is coming up real soon, and I'm just like, we, we you know, kind of order everything well in advance so that it can be here in time for us to make sure everything fit. And if we need to exchange or order again, we would do so. So I was just a little irritated off of that, so I had to find him. I want to make sure these parts look. identical and that does not y'all see that this part is more straight and this part is more it's like what time is it one o'clock in the morning But yeah, um, so I had to sit here and order him a new shirt. And that took me a minute. It just was unexpected things that had to be done today that I was not expecting to have to do because I already did it. That's why I was a little irritated about that. And just like I said, I wanted to have his shirt here in a reasonable amount of time to make sure he could fit it and everything like that because King is so skinny but he's kind of tall that looks about right he kind of tall so we have to try stuff on sometimes and what else happened then my oh my god y'all I had edited a whole hair tutorial video and I had to, all I had to do was the voiceover and I was trying to make space on my computer 
because it wouldn't let me save it to my hard drive because all of the uh, videos was imported on to Final Cut Pro. Long story short, I ended up trying to delete some stuff on my computer to make space so I could save it and I ended up deleting the fucking video. So irritated. So, I was just over it. I almost didn't record this video because I was so irritated about that video. That already set the bar, cause if you don't know anything about editing a video, that shit take a long, long time. And it's like, I don't have time to be wasted, okay? And what else happened after that? Something else happened, I don't know. Oh, then I couldn't find my SIM card. I just bought this SIM card that I'm recording on, 64 gig. I couldn't find it, so it took me a minute to find that. And I'm just like, huh, I'm tired. I wanna go to sleep. I really don't wanna do this video, but I need my hair done. I need to do my hair because I have a lot of stuff to do this weekend. <laughs> so your girl was heated, but I found it. Everything is all good. I found it. Okay, there we go. I'm gonna put a little bit of this edge control at the front of my hair, just to give it a more sleek look since I did not use a blow dryer. Let me just put it all around. Cause I love this edge control. I'll do wonders. Look, at, look how. Yes, the best, the best. And I'm gonna use my little comb to kind of smooth it out. So here we go, here we go. See what I'm actually doing. So I'm gonna take the front piece of my hair and I'm gonna split it in three sections. And then I'm gonna begin to braid my hair. You gotta know how to corn roll for this. You gotta know how to corn roll. Okay. I braided it like maybe two or three times and then I'm gonna attempt to add this weave. I'm tipped to add some more weave. We're gonna see how this look once I finish this braid because if this don't look right, we're gonna go to plan B. I'm on my second braid and I'm gonna show y'all again just in case y'all didn't see what I did. Um, I'm gonna just part the hair and take three strands and start to braid and then I'm gonna pick up um, a piece of weave, which I pulled out four pieces to um, add to this feed in braid. So I sectioned those pieces off before I actually, okay, before I actually start to add the weave. <sighs> Let's see if I can get up close and personal. So, I'm adding the weave in between these two fingers as I'm braiding. So I add the weave. I put this piece with that hair and I pull this piece to the front. I braid. Once and then I pull the hair back. And I repeat. So hard to do this in the cord. Okay. Break. Add the hair in between my index and my thumb. Push that piece to the back. Pull this piece to the front. Break. 
Next time I put my thumb and finger back on the hair, I'm gonna pull this piece to the back and braid. And I'm gonna repeat that two more times on this particular braid. I like because I was leaning down trying to explain to y'all what I was doing that I can break this underneath the last one, but what I'm not about to do is take it down. I'm not about to take it down. Yeah, the part is off. It's okay. It's okay. It ain't that big. It's my last piece of Adding in, I'm actually doing way better than I thought I would, y'all. <laughs> and pull this back. And then boom. I'm done. Then I'm just going to add some of this um, shining jam while I'm braiding. I'm just going to keep adding it. So it could help my hair blend with the weave and just make it look nice, neat, and shiny. So I'm gonna do a couple more braids and then I'm gonna come back. So I pretty much did this side. I did a good job, didn't I, y'all? That is to be my first time. Yes, I did a good job. So I'm gonna do this side real quick and let y'all see everything on camera. And yeah, y'all just watch me work. Watch me work. Again, I'm using Shine and Jam and this edge control. I live by this edge control. It does the hair wonders. Without this, my hair won't look this good, okay? Both is necessary, both is necessary. One conditions and the other lays the hair in place, okay? Now, I'm probably gonna speed this video up because I braid slow and I'm trying to braid you. <laughs> so yeah.
And I'm trying to cut the lace like not too close to the actual where the hair starts. Just in case I want to wear this wig a little bit different. I'm being careful. But yeah, like I was saying, when I was um, getting this wig, I was rushing and whatnot. So I didn't really have time to look for another wig um, in the color that my hair is like I really liked that this one they didn't have my color so I just took this color and she ended up actually giving me 40% off <laughs> so I went mad at that I was not mad like sis put it in the bag so I actually ended up paying $25 for this wig actually it was 23 something but um it's regularly, I think it's 39. I'm gonna uh, try to link it down below. Hopefully I can find it because I did go on the beauty supply and get this wig. But I'm sure it's online. Um, so right now I'm just adjusting it to fit my head and to be snug. There we go, okay. So I put them on the last straps in the middle here. Or hooks, I put them on the last hooks. Um, I'm gonna just put the y'all know I got this braid going across back here so I can hook these combs into the braid and make sure my wig is secure. I'm tender here, so I'm trying not to stuff this in here the wrong way. There we go. Oh, look at that, look at that. I'm gonna put the combs in in the back. There's only one comb in the back. But yeah, it's so, we're about to put these beads on. This is gonna be cool. I'm gonna put these beads on and I'm gonna be right back. I'm, I'm just applaud. This came out so much better than I thought it was. Like, I'm glad that I tried this hairstyle. Like, where have I, where have this wig been, honey, okay? Where have it been? But yes, y'all, I really love this wig. This is the finished look. tutorial as much as i did thank you all for watching do not forget to like comment and subscribe peace out It is 14 in the morning. And I got a lot of stuff to do tomorrow. <laughs> y'all ain't gotta go, but y'all gotta get the fuck up out of here. Anyways. <laughs> Signing off, but <laughs> yes, I got a lot of do to do tomorrow and it is 4, 11 in the morning. I had to get this content out for y'all. <laughs> Cause you're my dog, okay? You my dog, you my dog. If you watching this video, you my dog. Okay, I am cuckoo right now. How do I close this video out? What do I supposed to say? 
thank you all for watching. <laughs>